do they get them with the dog? Because I still don't know what really to say. Entertain you with Caleb! And one year old sausage dog. He's cute. A little protective of my dog. Barks at every noise. Today I'm super grateful for the iPad covers because I just made a huge mess by spilling a grease movie all over mine. And it's alive and it's well thanks to the iPad, iPad cover. And I have a huge green radioactive pile underneath me because my smoothies usually have a lot of spinach in them. But it's okay. I'm sure it's gonna dry up soon. It rained this morning, so I can't see it on my face. Swing. So I'm sitting on this bench instead. Can't quite swing on it, but I can imagine how it feels. <sighs> I spent like two or three hours yesterday shopping at the CVS pharmacy. The wonderland of goodies. <laughs> I don't know. Shopping is nice. I don't uh, I'll end up spending a lot of money, but do spend a lot of time. And, believe it or not, they have a, a 99 cents for like a whole huge big stick of 100% pure cocoa, cocoa, cacao butter stick. Amazing. This stuff in raw food stores is like, you know, like gold per gram. And it's 99 cents per whole bar. Couldn't quite figure out what's going on. Of course it's processed, not raw, but still. It's like, Rub it in all over me. Some super chocolatey today. So I like oh, and I bought another cool thing. I bought um, ever since my friend told me about growing aloe vera plants and giving it and them the plants, choosing the people that they want to go away with. It's like me. I want one too. I'm traveling all the time. How does that work? So. Lo and behold, CVS Pharmacy has a sale on the garden variety items and there is an aloe terrarium complete with like a little a pot with a glass, uh, plastic see-through cover so the plant doesn't get damaged and uh, gravel in the, the soil and the seeds so I'm gonna grow my own aloe vera and I understand that I probably want be able to bring it over with me to Vanuatu, Australia, but it's okay. I can leave the plant itself to somebody and take my little terrarium with me and start another one wherever I'm gonna write to, to Gravesend. And I'm gonna have my own healing plant. There's a whole little booklet about all the different diseases and little, you know, things that it can heal and how it can heal and how to ingest it. And I'm very excited. I'm gonna my own little living, breathing, apothecary with me. So I'm gonna grow it. So <sighs> I'm gonna have a new pet. We can travel with him. What else can I tell you? I just kind of spent a whole day resting this year. It was really nice. Talked to quite a few people. You see, it's quite amazing. I still like cover up my head around all these different people that I'm talking to. It's like, wow, I have friends. Wow, wow. <laughs> What's going on here? Yeah, it's cool. Um, wasn't much work yesterday, so that was good. And I actually got to go to bed a reasonable hour before 2 a.m., which was also good. And I'm just generally feeling really happy. I can get my hair this morning and it's shiny and soft and my skin is nice and luscious and I'm like, oh, thank God for humid climates. I, I think I was made for a humid climate. <sighs> so yeah, enjoying it very much. What else? Do -do -do -do. What's going on here, girl? Uh-oh. 
when you film, say hello. It's my morning vlog. Hi. <laughs> this is Russell, my dad. How's everybody? <laughs> Hope you're well. Anyway, did you blank. see this thing on the 